he started like, this is the, this is the shot, this is how the camera looks. You know, when you pull out a little bit more, um, you see this is 6K, and the picture is so lovely and everything, you know, and uh, this is 8K. And I was blown away at 8K, I was like, bam! This is, this is great. This is awesome. This is wow. I was already clapping like black magic did it. But they went ahead and they showed 12K. Hello guys. Welcome to another time out with me on Alec GTV. My name is Alec Godwin if you're just meeting me and um, today we are looking at this brand new camera for Blackmagic, the 12K for 10K, kind of. If this camera is for you, you will know. It's not hard to know, you know, depending on what you're caught out to do and what you want to do. Uh, but hopefully I can inspire somebody and uh, just the way I'm inspired right now to make this video. All that and more coming up. Welcome back guys. Now very quickly, um, if you're new to this channel, you might want to subscribe. You probably are the best guys for this <laughs> for this um, channel because you definitely clicked because you're interested to know why you're probably a filmmaker, um, director. You are definitely a creator of some sort. For you to be here, you're probably, you know, into film, you know, and you have the interest. So. It will be, uh, even though it's most likely you know better than me, it's still be, <laughs> you'll still be welcome here because uh, um, apart from that, this is a channel for um, growing minds, like filmmakers. Uh, I'm on a journey, typically you can identify yourself, but I'm on a, on a journey to Hollywood big dream someday, like I'm sure most of you ha are, and some of you are ready, living the life, uh, but it, this channel is about my documentary, okay, documentation of my experiences, my learning, my mistakes, my um, exploration, if you want to say so, um, so other people can learn as well, you know, and it helps me learn too. So bottom line is, um, it's for filmmakers, both young and experienced, you know, so you could either be a mentor or a co-learner, and we all learn together. Either way, um, I think uh, it's a healthy environment for you to be a part of. So in, to the general public, if you watch movies, if you like to watch movies, and they, or you like to learn how to make movies, then this is the channel for you. Now let's get into why I make this video. Hopefully it's a short one, but I'm really inspired by the Black Magic crew. Um, I, I was in the middle of making a video about my black magic uh, pocket cinema camera 4k um, one year review so I had to put that aside and get this video going because watching that live presentation from black magic design I was blown away it, it, something had to be right this is my generation this is our time this is I think we have no excuses. From what I found out, most directors never even get to own their own cameras. They keep renting and renting and renting. And this is understandable. Sometimes they, you know, for different films, they use different cameras depending on what they want to achieve. So why they might use the red today, they, they want to use the Analexa tomorrow. They are ready to be flexible and that's, that's good, that's understandable. But there's the baseline. If you plan to shoot a lot of movies, if directing and movie production is your thing, you want to have one, you know. I'm one of those that, you know, I've never said it ever before. But I've always had a feeling that I will have my Alexa Mini. I will buy almost anything I need on set, I will probably own. You know, I know this will scare the hell out of my wife, but 
that's who I am. That's, you know, I don't struggle with it. I, I just have it in my head. But here comes a relief that I won't have to pay all that amount, amount of money to get a 12K camera right now in today's world. I mean, I'm glad, I'm excited, I'm inspired that, you know, filmmaking is going to be a lot e cheaper for us, for this generation. Uh, right now, I'm halfway through film school, and uh, I'm like... You know, I can't wait when this is all done. Um, I'm fired up for the world out there after film school. I have a dream to make movies and all that. I am not, I'm not uh, one that will depend on finance or sponsorship. You know, not like I have all that money hanging around. No, I'm a fighter. I'm just going to keep fighting till I get my dreams achieved, you know. It's not... Uh, I hope to be sponsored, I hope to be financed by, you know, the big Hollywood industries and companies and uh, uh, studios, but I have to have a plan if, if I don't get that. There are a lot of talented people, there are a lot of very great people, great minds today. They probably get the shot before me, and if I do get there, fine. If even if I do get sponsored by the studios, it is for a period of time. It's under a contract. It's for like maybe, maybe you to do make several videos and then they might want to look somewhere else. At every point and time, you you still get back to being independent. So you will be independent most of the time. After each production, you're back to being independent. You are, you can make your movies. So. I see no reason why a film producer, a film director would not be able to own a camera like this all his film career life. I, I mean, especially we young filmmakers. I don't know how I'll get it. I don't know how soon. I don't know. I'm not like, I'm not like all pre-ordering right now. Like if it's available, oh, I'm not telling you that I have pre-ordered or I'm going to be ordering right now. I want to be, I wish to be, and I'm going to get it. But I'm saying is, I'm going to get it first. I'm not thinking about, oh, what's in my account? No, I'm going to get it, and I will get it. We are privileged. Now, we, are, we, we may not be as smart as the uh, Kubricks and all the great producers from back in the days, uh, directors from back in the days, but I think the technology that they didn't have puts us right back in the same plan, plane, puts us right back in the same status. These guys rocked the world, did all these wonderful movies um, <clears throat> without all this equipment. It's not a camera for everybody, you know, it's, it's, it's a camera for filmmakers for professionals and all that yeah but that's that's i may not have that all that title yet but that's where i'm going and and this camera is coming to me faster than i'm going getting to it so why not you know so the price it's ridiculous what you know i mean some people have bought their own cameras for 150 grand some people have bought 65 and all that but 10 grand for 12k not for 5K. Now, Amado bought the, the um, uh, FS9, which is like 5.9K for pretty much uh, close to 15 grand, for $15,000. And we are, now we are talking about 12K, which is double <laughs> the resolution for that. 80 megapixels, you know? That's awesome. That's just wonderful for, to have in our time. And I think I'm going to lay my hands on those, definitely. At the end of the day, you know, this is a, this is a generation I'm glad to be in. You know, forget about COVID-19, forget about all the troubles. Look on the good side, you know, you're, you're the way forward. I mean, if, you know, I have to lay my hands faster than the world is trying to end, you know, <laughs> because, yeah, at least I would have, I would have, 
done something, you know, by my dream, you know. Now, some people are going to say, well, it looks like the world is going to end. There's so much stuff going on. So I'm going to stop and see if the world is not ending. And hey, look, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But, you know, as soon as I instead, I think that, you know, if the world looks like it's ending, then I better be faster at achieving my dream and watch and run towards what I, I mean, I've I feel I'm caught up to do, so so uh, hopefully I'm making sense. Hopefully I'm inspiring somebody, and um, go get what you want. That's the bottom line. And I'm going out for what I want, and this is it's not a better time, you know. I won't see it as a wrong time. I think I think it's a sign that you know it's our time. It's our generation, and. Um, yeah, why can't we jump from this level to that level and operate on that level right now because it's this reachable. I would love to thank the Black Magic family for all their innovations for this. And uh, you really need to see me, uh, my reaction. I wish I got the recording of my live reaction to that, uh, to this camera when they unveiled it. You know, he was so, so nonchalant when he mentioned, if, if you saw it, in fact, I'm gonna show you, show you a clip of it now. You know, he started like, this is the, this is the shot, this is how the camera looks. You know, when you pull out a little bit more, um, you see, this is 6K, and the picture is so lovely and everything, you know, and uh, this is 8K, and I was blown away at 8K. I was like, bam, this is, this is great. This is awesome. This is, wow. I was already clapping like Black Magic did it. But they went ahead and they showed 12K. 12K. The next thing that went through my head was, just tell me the price. Let's let's know where I'm at. Just say the price. And <laughs> he'll still be around the bush a little bit more, you know, make you a little bit more comfortable. And he mentioned the price, but um, we are going to tag it at nine ninety nine fifty. What under ten k? I was blown away. Once again. Black magic has continued to blow the world away. And um, I think it's what supporting, what encouraging. If if they can do this and make this kind of camera, this kind of grant us this kind of access, I think we should go ahead and encourage them in turn. You know, we should return the favor and encourage them and commend them. You know, even if we can afford the camera, we commend them. But, you know, for those of us that are into film, that have this dream, that will not sleep without making it happen, reach out for the stars and grab this camera, you know, and make things happen. All right, so hopefully, you know, this has been inspirational to somebody. Just know, especially if you have the money right now, as soon as it is out, get it. If you want to make films, if you are caught out for, for you know, high-end production, get it. I'm gonna reach out for it, and uh, hopefully, God being on my side, I will get it. I will not just get the camera, I will get the movies out and make Make my dreams come true. I hope I shed some light. I hope I inspired somebody. Like, subscribe, uh, comment. Your feedback is always appreciated. You know, let's keep the conversation going down in the description. And um, I will see you right there. Appreciate your time. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Black magic.